Throughout the Milky Way galaxy, nebulae, which are clouds of dust and gas, take on mesmerizing shapes and forms. But there is a unique gas cloud that presents itself in an odd geometrical shape. Astronomers have named it the Red Rectangle Nebula. The Red Rectangle Nebula, a magnificent anomaly. Red Rectangle Nebula is located in the constellation of Monoceros, or the Unicorn, which is located 2,300 light years from Earth. Also known as HD 44179, Red Rectangle Nebula was discovered during a rocket flight launched to perform an infrared survey of the sky in 1973. However, the binary star in the heart of the nebula was discovered by an astronomer and binary star expert, Robert Grant Aitken, in 1915. The principal star at the heart of the nebula was similar to our own sun. It is nearing the end of its lifetime. It has been shedding its outer layers to produce the visible nebula for the last 14,000 years. It is a protoplanetary nebula as we see it from Earth now. In the future, when the star becomes progressively smaller, ultraviolet light is predicted to flood the nebula, making it fluorescent. Although initially appearing to be rectangular, Hubble Space Telescopes and Keck Telescope sharper images revealed it to be in the shape of an X. Another phenomenal thing about the Red Rectangle Nebula was discovered when the images showed a dark band of dust passing through the middle, obstructing the view of the central star. Astronomers determined that the central star is actually two stars orbiting each other, with a time period of around ten and a half months. One was initially believed to be a white dwarf, but it was later confirmed to be a normal hot star. The X shape of the nebula is caused by two conical emissions, one from each star, giving it the impression of an hourglass. The nebula exhibits an alien phenomenon known as the extended red emission. This causes the dust of the nebula to be red. This phenomenon was first discovered in the Red Rectangle Nebula. Over the years, it has been found in other parts of the Milky Way, and also other galaxies. The red glow remained a mystery for a long time, and some researchers associated it with ultraviolet light, which can produce photoluminescence. Later, some theorized that complex carbon-rich molecules called polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons, PAHs for short, are responsible for the extended red emission. PAHs are interesting molecules released during the burning of fossil fuels. They contain organic molecules called anthracene and pyrene, vital for the formation of life. However, they can be completely destroyed by the ultraviolet radiation produced by the central star. Recent theories say that most of the intense UV radiation is blocked by the clouds surrounding the binary stars. This may preserve the hydrocarbons of life. The exact reason for the geometrical shape of the nebula still remains a mystery. However, there are many theories surrounding this. The Dutch astronomer Vincent Eyck explained that shock waves from the interaction of the binary stars may cause the shape of the X, and ladder-like rungs that resemble a spider web can be caused by extra material deposited over the years. It has been theorized that the UV flux will ramp up significantly when this cool, mass-losing star eventually disintegrates into a scorching blue dwarf, and the entire object will glow as a planetary nebula. Further investigations from advanced instruments, like the James Webb Space Telescope, may unfold some of the mysteries that surround this magnificent anomaly. Thank you for watching, and please, Subscribe to the channel.